after a logging truck overturned on Highway 65 last June. Tonight, Fox 16's Victoria Price has reaction from this morning's ceremony. Anytime, every time people drive by, they'll see the sign. Nearly 12,000 drivers cross this bridge in Van Buren County every day. And now those 12,000 people will know the names of two men who gave their lives to build it. We hope and pray with this dedication and renaming of this bridge in some way will help ease your pain. Where Highway 65 crosses Archie Creek in Clinton, formerly renamed Tuesday for construction workers Hubert Keith Moore and Ricardo Trochez. Both men killed last June, 19 others injured, when a passing truck blew a tire, flipped over, and sent logs crashing across the work site. This is what he did, construction his whole life. But his job, it was, his work was everything. The truck driver, Jerry Hickman, later charged with negligent manslaughter and battery after officials discovered he was high on meth while behind the wheel. His actions tearing apart two families faster than those logs could spill across the highway. I got a phone call from my dad's ex-wife and uh, she said, Nikki, there's been an accident. And I called her back and I said, what do you mean an accident? Is everything okay? And she said, no, Nikki, your dad is he's dead. A year later, a sign finally stands to remember Nikki's dad and his co-worker and the loved ones these men left behind overwhelmed by such a gesture. This is an honor, absolutely. And so I'm honored. He's looking down, smiling, for sure. The city of Clinton didn't have to do this, and they chose to. It's a great way to remember them, both of them. Mm. Well, Hickman pleaded not guilty to both negligent homicide and battery. His case still has not gone to trial.